Hi everybody, this is uh, Jarno, PA3 DMI. Today I would like to show you how to make a simple j pal antenna for the 2 meter band. Well, what do you need? First of all you need a piece of wire, twin lead wire. They used to use it for making a small FM antenna. Nowadays they use coax, but it's quite uh, handy. Try to find it on the internet, it's only a couple of euros or dollars if you're outside Europe. A piece of coax with a, in my case, PNC connector. A tape measure, pliers, sharp cutting tool, and of course we need a soldering iron for making the connection. Well, first of all we have to determine how long the wire is that we need. Well, if you use it for two meter band, we need a wire. It has to be 139 centimeters, 0.7. Or if you're outside Europe, it's 55 inches. That's the main wire we use. And of course, always look if it's long enough. It has to be 139.7 centimeters. Better is to use one centimeter extra because we have to do some soldering and it will probably get a little bit shorter. So, if we draw the antenna, it's like two wires. For instance, if this 139.7 centimeters. This is one wire of the twin lead. We have another wire of the twin lead. On top, you just leave it open. You don't connect the wires internally from one side to the other. So that's okay. You don't have to solder. On the bottom side, you may have to make a connection. Just solder it. So if you have the wire, which is 139.7 centimeters, make the wire 140.7 because we need to cut a small piece of wire over here and over here have to solder it between them. Then we have to measure a distance, which is very important. First of all, we have to make a gap over here. This is a small gap. It's only six millimeters wide. So just use your pliers and just cut it over here. And the distance, that's very important, between this and this is 0.6 centimeters or a quarter of an inch. Well, where do you have to cut it? From the end of the wire until here, that's 41.9 centimeters, or in inches, 16 inch. Hope you can read it. This part is the quarter wavelength, and this is half a wavelength. So this is three quarters of a wavelength. Then we have to make a connection for the coax cable. Over here and over here. And the distance from the end of the wire till here is precisely 3.8 centimeters. Or 15 inches. Sorry, 1.5 inch reading from a small piece of paper. So between this and this, you connect the coax cable. The ground goes on this side, on the short leg. And the core goes on the long leg, over here. Just solder it, very simple. It's a simple antenna, you don't have to make any problems. And from there and there, code cable. Up okay. Up okay. 
If you use a coax cable, connect a BNC plug on the end or SMA if you want to use a small one. And you're done. So that's the principle of the j pole antenna. Now we're gonna make it. Well, first of all, we're gonna cut the wire to 139.7 or better 140.7. Next thing uh, we got to do is to strip the plastic off for one centimeter. Well, after that you have to bend both sides and solder them together. So from now on this is the bottom side. Next we have to measure one quarter of a wavelength. So that was 41.9 centimeters from the bottom, up that way, 41.9 or 16 inches. And we have to make a gap of a quarter of an inch or 0 0.6 millimeters. So, well, after making a small Cut over here. I always use a small lighter to get the excessive plastic off. So we have now two connections. Next is uh, to solder it and to connect a piece of cox to it. Next is to connect the wires together and don't forget where the wire is with the gap in it, that's where you put the shield on and the other side goes to the core. In my case the top side is the shield and the bottom side is the core of the coax cable. Well, when you're done, it's supposed to look like this. Next is uh, to test it if the SWR is okay, and then you can use it on a two meter band for repeaters and so on. Well, that's it. It works. Perfect. I can take it with me, small package. If you have space enough, you can put it in a small plastic pipe or just like me, just roll it and take it with you. Okay, any questions? Do it in the comments, please. Thank you.